Do you eat when you're bored? If so, maybe you can relate to Caitlin. She eats perfectly all day, but when she's home alone at night, it is a whole different story. She can't stop eating out of boredom. At least that's what she thinks. Boredom is related to the wish to do something. The way to alleviate boredom is to do something, to do an activity, to be active, to be productive. If you don't know what to do or what to do with yourself, or if nothing you do seems to work, maybe something else is going on. What could that be? Well, lots of people think they're bored when actually they're really lonely or empty. Loneliness is about wanting to be with someone. The solution to loneliness is to be with people, to be in the presence of another person or people and to feel connected. That last part is important. The experience of connection is crucial. There's no worse loneliness than when you're feeling alone in the company of others. People can be unreliable, unpredictable, or unavailable, which means that food can become a substitute for relationships. After all, food is reliable, food is predictable, and food is available. If you're lonely, maybe you're filling up on food as a way of filling a symbolic emptiness or loneliness. Emptiness has to do with feeling disconnected from yourself and your needs. When you're not attuned with your thoughts, your emotions, and your wishes, you may sense that something is missing, that you want more of something, but it's kind of vague. And this wanting more can even manifest as physical hunger. So think about this. Do you turn to food instead of to people? What experiences have made you afraid to seek out people? Does thinking about food give you something to do? Does it distract you from your thoughts and feelings? What would be most fulfilling to you right now? When you're alone, what feelings are most uncomfortable? And how did you deal with those feelings as a child? In fact, how did your family manage being busy or being alone, being reflective? The next time you eat out of boredom, take a moment and ask yourself if you're really bored or if maybe you're lonely or empty. If you're craving companionship, connect with other people in person, on the phone, or online. If you're empty, think about what would be fulfilling in the moment, an hour from now, a week from now. What do you need more of in your life? When you fill up your life, you won't use food one way or another for that purpose. And that's how you win the diet war. I'm Dr. Nina Savelle Rocklin, psychoanalyst and food weight and body image specialist. I'm here to help you kick the diet habit for good. And if you want even more support from me, sign up for my free three-day challenge to crack the code of emotional eating at winthedietwar.com. I look forward to seeing you there.